You'll follow me. I've got that. We're going outside. Yes. Okay. Just across here. So you have to go out to get back up again. Yes. And two twenty right here. Um, but this is not the hotel. This is our North Wing Motel. Now, why in the fuck would I want to stay in here? All we have available to rent in the hotel are four suites. I'd rather stay in there next door okay. than in this dump. I'm sorry. People want to stay in the hotel. They don't want to stay in the cracker box. Driving up here, I didn't expect to be put in a motel. No, I understand, and I'm, I am sorry. All right, it's just right over here. Thank you. You're welcome. Bloody hell. That sofa's hideous. Who would use a fucking brown sofa like that? Oh, my God, it gets worse in here. This bed, is this empty? Uh, no. The rooms are furnished completely with stuff from Philip and Ginger's home. Oh, dear. Is this a mattress from their house? Yes. You bring a mattress from your house into your hotel? I wouldn't. They charge $250 a night for that mattress. I don't even know what to say about it. When they get new stuff, they bring old stuff here. There's some storage rooms that are full of old furniture. Where are the storage spaces? Where Just is down the hall. Jeez. It's like a suite just yeah. full of crap. It's like a dumping ground. There's more, too. Wow, you are kidding me. I'm not. Oh, my God. Look at this. I wish this I was insane. kidding you. It's like a hoarder. It's just junk everywhere. I don't understand a hotel owner that would dump half their shit in hotel rooms and not rent them out. Gordon was pretty appalled at the state of the storage rooms, how much crap there was in there. It's just a big fucking waste. Okay. I appreciate it. You're very welcome. Thank you. Wow. This place is so disappointing. Wow. OK, I'm just to have a quick look round, and uh, mm -hmm. yeah, I'll follow you. OK. Um, what's all this out here? What is that? Oh, that's just for watering the plants? Yeah, and we get a lot of hikers, and wow. it rains here sometimes. What is that? Oh, who knows? It's been here a oh. long time. It, it's like Freddy Krueger's hat. <laughs> who, 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 who's this, this? It's just there for anybody that wants to borrow oh, it. Oh, I see. And does anyone borrow that, Karen? N they haven't no. yet. <laughs> Interesting. Another one as well. And what, are these <laughs> in use? They're for sale. They're, oh, they're for sale? Yeah, see? Summer hats. And how much are these? Three, three, to, three to 20. Three? Depends. And this is how much? Uh, maybe not more. Whatever you want to offer. Well, We're very flexible. I'm not too sure if this is my style. And, uh, oh, that's dusty. That's there. a pretty special one. Um, why is it so special? Because it's got. Full of dust. Yeah, West Virginia. Uh, and this much, is almost heaven. How much is that one? It's whatever you offer. Are these second hand? No, not that. Right. Some things are, but not that. <laughs> Man, it's your business. Are you okay. selling many? Are you are you busy? No. We don't really sell a lot of hats. I see. Mm-hmm. Oh, hello, you've got customers in already. Hello. This is my Hi, friend Sarah. Sarah. Mm -hmm. Sarah. Oh. Nice to meet you. <laughs> oh, well, good to see you. Nice to meet are you, you. joining us for lunch today or are you? I have no idea. I'm up to whatever. I'm here. <laughs> I do um, What does that mean? She's just a family fan. Oh, I'm fan a, okay, right. So you're not a customer. Person. I'm so sorry, right? I'm not a customer. Is this a convenience store or? This is a is dining it? room. Wow, I mean, it's very claustrophobic in here. It There's is. Bits and bobs of everything. And those um, freaky dolls, well, what are they for? They are sort of uh, souvenirs. Oh, are you selling lots? We do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow, a bit dusty. A lot of people who come here have children. They're looking for something to take back. What about this one here, the Collector's Choice? How much is this one? I think 25. <laughs> Jesus, so dusty. I didn't know they were for sale. You didn't know they're for sale. How much does this room make a month? Um, I can't give you an exact figure because we record right. the purchases in with the restaurant sales. Yeah. But I would say 15% of sales. 15%? Mm-hmm. Who drinks all this cider? Uh, no, actually, we use that in the restaurant. Jeez. Well, but we sell a lot of it. It's good in the summer, June, July, and August. Now, my daughter made those. Right. Uh, what are they? They're little hats for little children. It's full of dust and hair. And what's this? Hot pads. Handmade. Hot pads? Mm-hmm. Is that $60? Who buys this? People with children. I hope people with children. <laughs> That's full of dust inside. Well, you have to wash it before you use it. Look. And what's this? Uh, this made? is Sarah's journal. So she keeps a journal? Yeah. Wow. So it's, uh, it's almost like a novel. It is. And she puts sermon notes and telephone numbers and prices, wow. and she calls it her brain. A public bathroom decorated with baskets. Yeah, wow. she decorated the baskets up in my washroom. Oh. Oh, dear. OK. Wow. So um, All right. what's that there? That is a bottle holder. 
You can put like a water bottle in oh. it. So it's, it does appeal to hikers. Wow. I thought it was a jock strap. Do you know what that is? Oh, you know, it could. It looks uh, like a jock yeah. strap. I hadn't thought of that, wow. but you got a point. <laughs> What's that down this, there? That's our bread. And then behind that is the closet where our potatoes are kept. But uh, are, the, are the loaves for sale too? If someone asks for them. And hikers do sometimes, but normally it's. Um, it's just for the breakfast. We have toast. Are you expecting a lot of people? That's how much we go through in a few days, believe it or not. Really? Unfortunately, they're out of date as well. We couldn't. Are you serious? Second of November. OK, you're right. Today's the 6th. Oh, that's very embarrassing. Yeah. And this 5.30 at table 5. We want them ready, and we want to be ready for them. This place. My god. What happened to him? He didn't last very long, did he? He found our cat. <laughs> oh, bloody hell. Dead cat and a cabbage. Isn't that funny? Good Hello, welcome. Nice to meet you. Likewise, good to see you too. Gordon, first name is? Melissa. Melissa. Good morning. How are you? How are you? Lisa Croc. Lisa, nice to see you. You Hi. don't look very happy. I do. Oh, I, uh, oh, it's it's, it's my resting face. Wow. Um, yes, welcome to the Vienna. I'm so happy to be here. What happened to the cat? <laughs> Poor thing. Cat got run over. Oh, I see. And you got it stuffed? For Halloween. Right. Actually, better to see you now. Right. Um, yeah. Uh, love the attire, by the way. Thank you. Everyone wears this. Wow. How much are the outfits? About $300, $400. Three hundred dollars. Average, you know. They get their own. I mean, they're their own dresses, you know. Oh, you buy your own uniforms? Yes, yes. they do. Stop it. We do. Well, they have them for many years, and it reminds them to not gain here. weight. <laughs> wow. So, who designed the place? Well, uh, my husband and I. And whose idea was it to buy it? Uh, my husband. So it wasn't yours. It was not my idea, actually. Very much against it. Wow. Uh, uh, why were you against it? It was very overwhelming. I had two small children, but probably uh, after I lost my mind the first year, I think we started to get a hang of it. And who's Austrian? Are you from? My husband's half Austrian oh, I and see. Polish. Right. I, I'm not nearly as exotic. I'm very no. American. Right. And he's the chef, right? So he runs the restaurant kitchen and you run the inn. Correct. And whose idea was the uh, violins on the table? Mine. Where did that come from? That was actually from an estate sale down the street. A dead man's violin? No, yeah, no. why not? I don't want to sit across the table with my wife and look at a dead man's violin. Well... A bit freaky, no? I don't know. What would you rather look at when you see the Vienna? Her. Who's her? Uh, my wife. Oh, your wife, yes. Yeah. But you have to have something in, to make up that white space. What would you suggest? Uh, my wife. <laughs> You're going to put her on the table? That's so kind of scandalous. I am so fucking confused. Dead man's violin. What about some flowers? Bloody hell, is this place always as clustered as this? And who's that there? A Prussian family, of course. That was uh, Friedrich, that uh, their family all was murdered. Uh, murdered? So hungry. Yes. Wow, so dead man's violin, mm -hmm. uh, murder on the wall. Um, great story to uh, encourage a nice, warm, welcoming dinner. Oh dear, what happened there? Damn. When did that happen? You know, it's been here since I've been here. Oh, really? Hi, I'm Marianne. This place is Marianne. Too. Likewise, to good Africa. to see you. I get a bit nervous when I check into a hotel. The windows are smashed. Uh, uh, anyway, how are you? I'm good, thank you. I'm happy to be here. Are they bullet holes in the wall? Uh, you know, they might very well be. I'm not sure what they are. We're 250 years old, so. 250 years old? Mm -hmm. uh, what's wrong with the place? I think it's a beautiful place, but I think it really just needs some upgrading. And uh, which part's beautiful? Help me. Certainly not the entrance with the smashed windows. Well, I think it could be beautiful. Yes. It's been neglected for a while. What happened here? Oh. <laughs> oh, my. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. <laughs> that looks much better. Wow. Oh. Dear, oh, dear. No, Brenda's not going to be too happy. <laughs> you just ripped the wallpaper down. That was fantastic. What time is Yona calling in? She might be here. I can check. I'd for love you. to meet her. Oh, he's bringing Verenda up. <gasps> Verenda. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Yeah, very well. A little nervous. Mm -hmm. The smashed glass. What happened there? It's been there since before I bought it. 
Uh, yeah, how long have you had the hotel? Ten years. Ten years? Yeah. And you didn't think about replacing it? First impressions, customers walk through the door. It's, it's the original. Have you been drinking? <laughs> you look like I drink. <laughs> did you run a hotel before you bought this, ten years ago? Yeah. Never. No? Never. <laughs> now, what, what did you do? Therapist for children. I did that for 20 years. That was my practice. Wow. OK, uh, 201. I'll see you uh, shortly. I'm going to go and check in and uh, unpack. OK. Uh, place is filthy. Uh.